Hey guys, it's Way here, and welcome back to another FIFA 17 Ultimate Team video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to complete the Team of the Week 17 Guaranteed Informed Squad Builder Challenge the cheapest and easiest way. I'll also be showing you the pack that I do get from completing the Squad Builder Challenge, so if you guys already know how to complete an 84 rated team cheaply using the 84 rated team formula, then I do have a great pack for you guys at the end of the video as well. It's actually a walkout in form, so stay tuned for that. But for those of you who don't know the formula, even if maybe like 10 of you don't know, because I know a lot of people already do know the formula on how to get an 84 rated team very easily and cheaply. Even if there's only 10 people who don't know that watching this video, that's still 10 people who are going to be able to complete this Squad Challenge a lot cheaper than normal. Because for those of you who don't know, there is a formula that can get you an 84 rating a lot cheaper and a lot more easily than most of the other 84 rated teams that you'd make. Because normally to make an 84 rated team, you need like 6 or 7 84 rated guys. So you need a lot of high rated players. Whereas with the formula, you only need 2 84 rated players, you need 8 83s, and you need 1 80 rated player. That's it. Very, very easy and very, very simple. You guys can see on screen right now the actual players that I used. And it doesn't really matter about the, the actual players. You guys don't need to use the same players as me. You just need to use the same rating. So just use any 8 83 of players you do have. Maybe you have some untradeable ones or just get the cheapest ones you can find on the market. Goalkeepers are generally quite cheap. And you do only need 30 chemistry, so positions and chemistry is not too important. The 80 rated player, again, you can just use like a non-rare that's very cheap. And the 84s. You're looking at normally the goalkeepers again, like Hart, Pepe, Reina, players like that, who are about four to five thousand coins, and it should be good. It is an easy one to complete using cards like that. It's probably going to cost you around thirty thousand coins, and right now the team of the week is very, very good. You've got Higuain, Isco, Eriksson, some really, really good players like that who are walkouts uh, with Eriksson and Higuain, and also you do have a lot of kind of mid-range players who are still pretty expensive and really good, like Iago Aspas, who's eighty-six rated, and some players like that. And even down at the bottom, there are still some really good players. You've got uh, just some decent players who are like 20 to 30,000 coins. There's only like one or two players who are discard price who aren't that good. And that is the Italian right back who plays in the Liga Santander. I'm not sure on his name. And also Bastos. But other than that, everyone sells for a bit. So it's definitely one I would recommend completing. And yeah, you can get some really good packs. So... This is the team I've completed. As I said, you don't need to go and get exactly the same players. Just get the same ratings, and it is very, very easy and uh, quite cheap for you guys to complete as well. So without further ado, let's go on into the pack and see what I managed to get. Because as I said, it was a walkout, and it is a very, very good pack. So as you guys can see on screen right now, this is the pack that I did manage to get. And as you see, it does pause. It is a walkout. Huge flare comes out. It's obviously an inform card, and the Danish flags drop down. It is... I think third in form, Christian Eriksen. He's had so many informs this year, and he's very, very likely to get a winter upgrade. So that 88 red card could become like 89 or 90 rated in the next couple of days. But look at his stats. He actually looks ridiculous. Probably the best Premier League attacking midfielder now on Ultimate Team. 93 passing, 91 dribbling, some really good stats. Five star weak foot and four star skill moves. And that is in my first pack from the School Builder Challenge, which is ridiculous. I mean, last week I did the same thing. First pack, I got an inform walkout Cesc Fabregas. And this this school bit of challenge right now definitely would recommend it. Same with last week's one. There weren't many bad informs last week, and if you did it, you normally would get some decent players. Same with this week, there are only one or two bad players, so definitely would recommend it. If you do it once, you're still pretty likely to get a good player. But if you do this like five or six times, you're almost guaranteed to get a really, really good player. At least like an Isco, an Iago Aspas, or a very, very high-rated person like that that you can use in score with the challenges maybe in the future. And even someone like Shawcross is always useful for player of the month score with the challenges and all those things like that. So it is definitely a score with the challenge. I would recommend you guys trying out. It'll cost around 30,000 coins if you pick up the cards for the cheapest prices they go for. But yeah, hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, leave a like, and that would really, really help me out. Subscribe if you're new around here as well. And yeah, we could smash 200 likes for the insane pack that we managed to get at the end, and also the formula did help you out. That would be awesome. But so yeah, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in my next video. Take care. 